What's this person? Cured? Your name, child? Luzia Silvano Cardoso. So was her leg like this? Yeah, my leg was like that. What did the doctors tell you? They told me that they would cut off my leg. You cut off? They would cut off? Yeah, cut off. Cut off my leg. Oh, and God. a bag like this of remedies that I've taken. I can and see. And never, the cure didn't come. Did you hear what she just said? What did the doctor tell her? They had cut it off. It was the only way. Was it rotten? April 12th. Was it rotten? It was. Did it hurt? Uh, sting too much, hurt. Bad smell. Yeah. April 12th, I came here with my granddaughter. When I arrived, I was there in the corner. You passed and took the hand to my side towards me. And it was April 12th. As I came back home. And you didn't reach me with your hand, but God reached me. And when I arrived at home, it was already being healing. Wow. And then my granddaughter doesn't walk, doesn't talk, but now she starts walking. It's wonderful. And she never walks. No, she's never walked. Never. How old is she? She's 20. April 12th, she turned it Wait, 20. She's 20 and she's never walked. And she never cried. Never cried. She never talked. Now she speaks. Now she cries. Mom, dad. She's crying. Can she hear me? Now she speaks. Can she hear me? She listens. Can she move her legs? Yeah. May her stand. May her stand up a bit. She's 20, but she has never walked. I never cried. Now she does cry. She started walking. Now she's gonna run up here. Church, 20 years, crippled at birth. Come here, family. Church, God of this church is God of Bible. God of this church is the God of the Bible. Come here, man. Show it. Granny, look at that girl who has never, look, show her legs. She has never walked, she's 20. Just working on her life. What? Her mother gave her to me. God gave her to me. Show the legs of this girl. Show it. Show the legs of this lady. April 12th. It was just poos. It bore to the bone. The bone. And did it bore to the bone? It was. Now look at here. You can see. Are you showing it? Are you showing it? I suffered a lot. Just me and her. How long have you suffered? Five years. I have walked away, raised, lifted out my hand, but I didn't touch it. No, didn't touch me. Almost touched her, but not me. Jesus touched her. Jesus touched her. What do you feel? When I just saw the wind of your hand, but there were too many people. It was impossible for you to get close. But Jesus touched her. But Jesus touched me. And you're healed. I'm healed. And she is well. She never stood before in 20 years. 20 years. Never ever cried. No. Unable to speak or to walk for 20 years. Do you understand that? But she's standing now. Look at that. 20 years. Huh. She's 20. October 2. Oh, I was here with her and she was turning 20 years old. Never walked or cried. No, never. And you wounded like that. It was like this. But Jesus visited you. Jesus visited me. Praise the Lord. Congratulations. Praise church. Go on, help her out. This girl's gonna lead a normal life. It's just too many miracles. People. A lady who was never able to stand a up. Apostle, I was healed of stroke in two hours. In 20 years. That's the kind of thing we only see in the Bible. And in this ministry. Do you agree with me? Who has the stroke? 
two hours. The stroke. First, aneurysm. And then I came back home in two days. And after that, I came back to the intensive treatment. I received visits of servants that I didn't know. And they asked to pray. They prayed on me. And then they put the little towel on my head and I slept. The towel. Be, be you a blessing. It's private people from the church. And so apostle. Until 57 years, I didn't have a TV at home. I hadn't had to be a set at home. I didn't know. I had no idea all about the ministry of God of the church and Apostle Valdemiro. The day that I woke up, because God had a beautiful plan to rescue me because I was terrible. I cured. Apostle, when they put the little towel on my head, two hours that I woke up, I took everything out. The device. I had tubes. Who took it, it all right off? Here. I took everything out. Oh, Jesus. I did everything in bed and have a shower in bed, everything in bed. I took everything out. I went to the bathroom by myself like this, Apostle. Perfect. You were cured. Healed. Healed. What doctor tell you? Apostle. It was like everybody were astounded. Even in uh, the situation, everyone, all the doctors came because I had just opened the head because of aneurysm and they got lost. They didn't know what to do, if they open again or not. They let me to have, uh, to check what would happen, but I didn't do anything. And that's what happened. It happened that apostle. Jesus visited you. Apostle. Everything, from everything, I thank God, I thank for my life, but the most beautiful thing, it was be rescued by Jesus. I arrived at this house, meet you, the band, everything, because when I got here the first time, and the little towel doesn't have the worldwide church. The little towel does have the address, and so when I recovered, I was changing the channel until a Tuesday. That bishop that is in Portugal, Josivaldo, she has a party with it's the little towel, mess. and I, she has a party. But as my sister said, Fatima, come here, I found the, the little towel. Ah, uh, you didn't know that the towel was from the church. No, I didn't know. Then you realized it was from the world. Right? And then I saw it was this ministry, and I saw the miracles, and the, and the evil living. Then you realized why God is rich. Apostle, God rescued me. God loves to you. Took my heart and loved me. Are you happy? My Apostle, how happy I Come am. Come here, give Apostle a hug. Oh, thank Praise you. Praise Jesus' name, church. It's impressive. <laughs> Who's your cancer? Congratulations, child. Jesus really loves you. Do you like music? Uh, do you like band? Go on, ham. Tell me, child, what's your name? Nate. You're crying. I am. You're emotional. I am. Where do you live? Curitiba. What is your condition? Cervical cancer. Who told you? I had the exam. So that's true with it? Yes. But you don't have it anymore. Thanks God. Jesus cured you. Jesus healed me. And Jesus is wonderful. Jesus is wonderful. It's great. Thanks God. How'd you find out about the church? Through a friend of mine. And she invited me. And I started coming and sinking with four days, four or five days. I found out that I didn't have any more. <gasps> it was kind of fast. Yeah, it was very fast and then... You got before and after. I have. It's great. It's your daughter. Yeah, my daughter. Were you aware of a condition? Yeah. And of the miracle too? Sure. 
Muriel's best, right? Sure. Come on, give us a hug. I found Parana. Send a kiss for Parana. God bless you all. What's in Parana? What? You forgot the city? Aren't you from Parana? Kajiba. Do us a shot there. God bless you. God bless you all. Such a blessing. God bless Parana. It's great. Amen. So receive it. So if they ask you, you can show the test. Yeah. From before and after. I had my hopes. The doctor said there's nothing. Nothing anymore. No. It won't ever show anything again. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Let us go in peace.